Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. My name is Neil Outs and this is episode 7 of our Let's Play. Isn't it 7? I think it's 7. Uh, we are going to figure out what we are going to do. The Seas of Fate. I wonder what that might be. Let's see if we can get in here. Knock, knock. It's Eivor. Open the door. Come in, but keep your voice down. You will alert Harald's men. <laughs> Where will we live? The English will fight back. Two days ago, we rid this land of Kurtve and his dogs. Yet today, we do not celebrate. Today we cower under a cloud of fear. But it need not be like this. We are not the heel-trodden subjects of a boy king. We are the Raven Clan. Our destiny is our own. Did you know about your father's oath to Harold? I did not. And for that, my anger burns hotter than any man's here. But I will not let that drive me into despair. We cannot stay in Norway. Not under Harald's boot. Not without fueling more war. So we push forward. To newer lands. Hmm. So who is actually plotting this? Is it truly Sigurd or is it Basim? make a new home. A kingdom of our own. The sons of Ragnar Lothbrok have been in England eight winters already. Is there any land left for a clan of our size? More than enough, wife. Of the four kingdoms of England, only one is truly pacified. I have no desire to wear Harald's leash. I like this idea. A saga for the ages, I agree. <laughs> it will take time and resources to build ourselves a new home, but the riches taken from Kjotve's raid would suffice. No. That belongs to my father, as a fair compensation. In England, we must start anew. You would start us with nothing? In a land we do not know? Among people who hate us? Yeah. Kjotve's riches would go some way to easing our passage, Sigurd. I bested him. It is within my rights to claim his goods. Our leaving must not be an assault on my father. It is a time of renewal for us. He is very, uh... He's very wise, Sigurd. Let's not uh, let's agree with him. If you object, you find new resources. I understand. Let your father keep Kjotve's riches. England will have riches and cargo enough for us. Exactly. Good. I did not want this cloud hanging over us. It is a wise leader who considers the need of others. To England, then, before the day is out. Pack what you need, but no more than that. And tighten your lips. The last thing we need is the attention of Harald's troops. All right, off to England to greener pastures. Pastures? Yeah. How much did you hear? Enough. A new path is revealed and your journey will be challenging. Will you not join us? For my mother's sake, I cannot. But our threats will cross again before the final day. Until then, farewell. Yeah, maybe we can lure her over once we've settled. How about that? Leaving this beautiful countryside. Leaving this weather in favor of the English weather. They are sorely mistaken. But then again, there are monasteries to plunder. And we have already done all the stuff we wanted to do in in the beginning. so Or in the end of last episode. So we can just go straight in without further distractions. Please don't let me get distracted. Sigurd at the docks. Alright, we're ready to head out. I love that they speak Icelandic in the background. I love it. Better than they speak Norwegian, to be honest. Eivor, the wind favors us. We should set sail without delay. You made quick work of packing. Well done. The dream of new lands is a powerful lure. As is the promise of glory. But the act of leaving so beloved a home, there is a sadness to it. Having doubts? No, not at all. The die is cast. Well then done. Let fate guide Quoting Caesar. Journey. Are you ready? It's time to go. I'm ready. Let us take to the water and leave unbothered while we have the chance. That chance has passed. Look. Fate flies on swifter wings than we. King it's just the one. Banner. Just one ship. Sigurd, 
What is this assembly? What are you planning? An exit, father. As graceful as I can. For if I cannot be king in the land of my birth, I will start a new saga. In England. Nonsense. Your place is here, son, at my side. There will be other victories soon, other glories. My choice is made, father. Do not hope otherwise. It is easy to lose one's way on the road to glory. Do not let false victories blind you to what is true. You talk of false victories to me, old man? A sad old bear who destroyed his honor with one bent knee. The further I sail from this place, the louder I will sing. I will be his anchor, Lord. No, you must be his better half. May Agir bless your voyage. Agir? I would say Agir. So we got a bit of raw materials, not a lot of raw materials, and a bit of supplies as well, but not much. Because we did not steal, steal the... well, not steal, but... Appropriate the loot. Oh man, I'm not even commanding the ship when Sigurd is here. That sucks. I'm just rowing like a scrub. Time for tears is over, you weeping sacks of wool. Put some muscle into those pools. Ration your strength, dog. We have an ocean to cross. All right, you lazy back route. Sigurd, what's our course? The sons of Ragnar established a settlement near the coast. We set sail for that. There's not much rowing going on there. To lift out ah. To rouse the gods! Inspire a mighty fart from Thor to speed us on our way! Oh, that's not what I wanted. I thought there was like a cinematic view. A new kingdom awaits. You know England well from your troubles. I spent a season in their kingdom of Mercia. A temperate land. Lush and wild. By now the sons of Ragnar will have claimed its heart. Do we mean to join their army? They will join ours. In time, all of England will know of Raven Clan and the glory we brought to that fractured land. So to England! Glory and destiny! To England! To England! Or Valhalla! <laughs> or, or Valhalla. There we go. That is the tutorial is done and the game actually starts now. I love the fact that it's just like so far into the game it goes, all right. Now the game starts. So now things get really weird. Like now we are going out of the animus and taking a look at Layla Hassan. I suppose not what her name is. Layla, at least. This is so weird. This is what us YouTubers, streamers look like when we plug out. <laughs> the staff of Pythagoras. Wasn't it Pythagoras? communications, dangerous bands of radiation around the poles, and as we can all see from our window, an aurora borealis that never burns away. Unfortunately, we are stumped as to why this is happening, and if we cannot find an answer soon, it may change the way we live, the way we communicate, even the way we evolve forever. Dr. Sirka went on to say, Bought you more electrolytes? Oh, new and improved citrus flavor. Thanks, Sean. Earthquakes as well.
How do we fix this? How are you the key to everything? I don't know. Look, he has a shield. So that must be. Uh... You're a long way from home, Avor. Hmm. Yeah, so that's Eivor, and we are currently not in England. Did you get my tea? Oh, mint tea is not actually tea, Bex. It's an infusion. It's really just dirty minty water. I don't care what you call it, Sean. Did you buy any? Of course I did, love. Hey, sorry about pulling you out. The generator was sputtering. That's fine. I needed air. How was the Animus data stream? Comfortable? Felt pretty stable after a while. Good. Just give me a sec and you can jump back in. Another satellite came down. Did you see? I did. One of Abstergo's. That's good. Well, most of North America just lost its GPS service, so... Depends what you mean by good, really. Right. Even when we win, we lose. Okay, we're all set. Whenever you're ready, you can jump back in. Yeah, but let's, um... There's at least one thing I want to see, and that's over here. We can talk to him. Hello, Layla. Sean, what do you make of the grave out there? Well, it overturns a few hundred years of scholarship about the first Europeans to set foot in North America. Apart from that, it's just a bunch of muddy bones, isn't it? Can we talk about this thing on my years. neck for a second? Ah, the mood stabilizer. Yes. It's not harmful, is it? I mean, I feel good, but I want to make sure there's no side effects. There shouldn't be. It's only blocking outside signals. A passive effect. So the staff doesn't, you know, mess with you. <laughs> the staff. Sean, <laughs> what happened last year, I, I had no control over that. I, I tried to resist. I understand. And your old team? Maybe they don't. But we've seen that sort of thing before. Still, if you want to work with us and get to the bottom of... Why the world is about to end for the second time in eight years. Then you wear that thing until we say otherwise. William's orders. I know. It's not a problem. It's just a few more weeks, yeah? Just until we figure this out. You're right. I know you're right. <laughs> People who say, just a few more weeks. That's, that's just stringing you along. Let's read this. Sean has been busy. A strange, an audio fragment sent from an unknown location to our encrypted service. Nothing was stolen, nothing corrupted. Just a quick deposit and gone. We just got lucky this time. So what is it? A cryptic sound file. Voice unknown with a signal beneath it. The signal was a code led us to a precise spot here in New England. We dug and a good lord we struck gold. Well, silver dominant currency in the dark ages. Point is, it was a gravesite. A Norse warrior dating to the 9th century, early 10th century AD. A few hundred years before the earliest known settlements. The big news? This is big news if you have it right. Question remains, how did these bones get here and why? Good point. Do you mind if I put some music on? Go for it. Cool. Uh, I guess, the, who is the first? Okay, let's not do that. Thank you, DMCA. Why did I do that? No, don't keep talking so it doesn't register. The YouTube algorithm doesn't kill my channel because of DMCA requirements. Ah, turn it off. God damn it. Damn it. Fucking hate music. It's just music is just pure toxic. Any music played anywhere on YouTube and you just goodbye. Hello, DMCA. You gonna put this in the fridge, Sean? Of course. In half a minute. Remember, tomatoes go on the counter, not the fridge. Ah, that's important. Please enjoy your stay. Remember, all the garbage must be packed out and please water the plants once a day. Yeah, I won't remember that. Sean, don't forget to water the plants while I'm under, okay? I'll add it to the calendar and tattoo it on my leg. So I guess it's time Sean, to dive okay. back in. Better. But I'm worried that it could happen again. The two data streams. I can't promise it won't. 
I barely understand it myself. It felt like two minds fighting over one brain. It hurt like a shotgun to the head. Right. There's something about this Viking's DNA sample that feels dense, noisy. Could it be the staff? Interfering somehow? How do you mean? My headaches, my temper. They started the day I got that thing. I hope you're not making excuses for, you know, your friend. Jesus, no. I'm not. Hmm. Sorry. Weird. Just take it easy. And if you feel yourself slipping again, let us know. I'm trying. I really am. Alright, let's go back under. Okay, th there's a couch. Be nice to sleep in a real bed when this is over. There. And to the animus. Back in. Alright, time to go. Norway to England takes about a week by long ship, so I'll scrub ahead. Hmm, nice. Scrub ahead. Wasn't the original Animus designed, like the very first Assassin's Creed, designed to be able to read damaged DNA? And now here... Bella, you okay? We have one that says, oh, it's too Sorry. damaged. Can you play the message again? We have the transcript. If you're looking for something, I can no, come in. No, I want to hear it. Okay. I don't mean to be cryptic. It's just... That message led us here. To this place. To a Norse grave in North America. So those bones out there are the only lead we have. Our only chance at fixing this planet before it's too late. Here it is. Seems odd. I lived. I died. And now I sleep. And in my sleep I dream. And in my dreams I see an end to the doom that will grip the earth once again. Find the wolf kissed. Find the mad one. Find me. And save us all from another death. So that's clearly three different people. Unsettling, wolf kissed, that is. Mad one? Is that the that Odin? That in the message. Are you sure it's just coordinates? I Nothing think Odin else? is the mad one. Nothing I can find. Okay, I'm ready. Here we go. And this is, it. it's great to get these kind of snippets of, of lore, but it's also really difficult to get back into the Viking lore when you just got pulled out so hard and then get dropped back in and go like, uh, what are we doing again? Oh yeah, looting and pillaging. 873. There she is, England, our new home. Not a patch on Norway, but we'll make this land our own soon enough. I'm glad to see any land at all, and will be happy to have my feet on solid ground again. We must not rush our landing. All you see here is Saxon territory, the Kingdom of Mercia, largely unpacified. There will be eyes watching us from the trees, with bows drawn and traps set. We must be wary. Ranvi! Take in your oars! All standing! Have you spotted something? Not yet. Well, let us go ahead to clear the path of any dangers. Then follow our lead when the sun brushes the horizon. Understood! May Thor bless you all on your way! We will see you soon! Sail on! Yes! I'm ready for whatever these green-thumbed fairy folk <laughs> have to throw at us. Well, Sigurd, well do the sons of Ragnar know that we're coming? They do not. For well, they will not scoff at our visit. Of the four kingdoms in England, the sons of Ragnar have settled only one. The rest is ripe for the taking. Do we mean to join their army? No. No. We will speak with them, get the lay of the land, and carve this country into as many pieces as we see fit. Look ahead there. Is that what passes for a town? Plain brick in a single rune to their timid god? That rune is called a root, Doug. The cross upon which their god was sacrificed. A root? It sits atop a monastery, a place of worship. That cross killed their Christ, and now they display it in worship? Bizarre. 
We carve idols of our gods and make wishes before them, like our sacrifices to Odin, the One-Eyed. But we do not worship the wolf that kills him! That is the difference! Whatever strangeness we see in these Saxons, they must think the same of us. The hammer! Now there is a symbol worthy of a god. A bolt of lightning would take that cross clean off! <laughs> This is very nice. Look there! What are they doing? Ritual drowning. Baptism, Dag. Are the ways of Christians really so unfamiliar to you? Not at all. Ritual I drowning. I forgot. And someone has to keep the conversation up. It must be priests and worshippers alone in that place. We could storm this port with ease, sack it without breaking a sweat. I like so your in thinking. The way of treasure there? Always! They shape precious metals and cut jewels to their gods. There will be a fortune there. Later, Dag. There will be time enough for raiding once we have settled. I like Dag. He's, he's very simple, very straightforward. Not Don't much surprising there. The Way forward is blocked by a chain spanning the river. We must remove it before passing on. A chain? Can we cut through it? It's too thick for access. But there must be a way to release it from somewhere in that camp. I will go. And I will be right behind you. No, Dad. You stay here. I don't know why I'm stuck away. in this view. I want you defending the ship. A good idea. Send out the arrow and keep your sharpest axe at hand, huh? Something like that. Something like that. <laughs> Can I move? When can I move? No? No moving? No movement. Maybe I maybe my controller is dead. Maybe I don't have any controller. Oh that's all lovely. Since when did that decide to die? Uh, uh that's not it. Okay, I think we're in trouble here. I think it's switched. No, it is on the controller. Okay, so it just fell asleep across the ocean. We can go. Whoop. Alright. Chain, you say? Let's scan the surrounding. Dive down. Oh, we have two skill points. Must have gotten those across the the lake, across the pond. We'll work our way towards the spending. Oh, what, did, what do we have here? Advanced assassination. Boom. That's a. It's really difficult that part. Alright, let's bump ahead and see if we. What we can see. Do we have anyone up there? Yeah, we do. I must be careful now. Two more. A few. Let's see if we can also get him with an arrow. Like there's only one in there. No more guards out there. Looks like he's got his this back chain turned. Is huge and poorly anchored, it appears. I might be able to shoot it. 
Read. River chain. After conducting several trials, we have found that these naval chains will hold against even the most durable Danish longships, as long as the mechanism remains intact. Oh, oh, someone's seeing us. Where? Oh, there. Oh. Alright, uh, so good against long ships. Yes, good. Ooh, titanium. Best defense against forthcoming incursions. It's imperative that these blockades remain intact. Good stuff. And of course, we want a chest as well. Did I just get a wooden leg? Lovely. Arrows, that's fortunate. More arrows. So in case I repeatedly miss this. Okay, great. You're done. Path is clear. Okay. Here comes Change the ship. Away. Hey boy, back to the boat. Yeah, well, Keep get closer. Barring any more surprises. No, 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 no. That was not a glory glorious jump. All right, let's get back to our humble seat. I do prefer to be at the the captain's chair or captain's. I don't know. Fine work. I say we go back, Sigurd. Give those dogs a good knock around and take whatever treasures they have. Easy pickings. Not today, Dad. We press on until we reach our goal. We cannot afford another surprise. Now be on your guard. It should not be far. Gods, I'm ravenous. I hope they have food and the ale on hand when we arrive. You should have sent word ahead of us, Sigurd, to get something on the spit. If exactly Hapka how would you Luba send word ahead? If on a lacking food in England, then all of us will starve. <laughs> have no worry. Ah, I can see it now. A suckling pig tender and juicy. And the ale as gold as the treasures mm. that we failed to steal back And there. again, we're back to eating and drinking. Pleasures, aren't you, Dag? And he is happier for it. For my part, I look forward to standing in the footsteps of the giants that built this land. What giants? The great Romans and their empire. Giants of a forgotten age. They held dominion here long ago, and their ruins dot the landscape. Every brick and stone tells a story of conquest and glory. And now, they are rubble and ash. Ready to be remade. We will rebuild their empire, brick by brick, and ours will not crumble to dust. All things end, dog. Ruins are not a warning, they are a testament. Look there, just ahead, where the sons of Ragnar make their camp. At last, to find our feet on steady ground. Sigurd, hold back. Something isn't right. Good eye. There's too little movement for an army. Even sitting there with the back turned. And a few men. Not the army we hope to find. No. Let us get a closer look. All right. That means I'm sailing. Or maybe. Am I? I don't know. I don't think I am. Those Grand are not They're too ragged and soiled. We should <laughs> proceed them to too ragged and soiled to be Norsemen. <laughs> Dag and I will go together. We all go. If they are friends, I wish to meet them as a yarl. And if they are foes, then we fight them well, together. Let's see. Ragnarsson's encampment. Oh, I'm supposed to be anchoring, mooring over here. Come on. Oh, it's getting in there of itself. Who are these men? They speak with twisted accents. English, no doubt. Dark Eivor! On me. All right. They must be friendly. They are always friendly. <laughs> they look friendly. <laughs> oh, what's this? A mess of filthy Danes befouling our riverways? <laughs> you there? Give us your name. I am Sigurd Jarl of Fornberg, and you are... Men who do not take kindly to Dane invaders creeping into our camp. You'd Makes best sense. move along, pagan. Spare yourselves a slaughter. 
You threaten Norsemen with a play of swords and expect us to cower? <laughs> I have been eight days at sea without a drop of blood to wet my axe. So spare the chatter, Bakarout, and draw your weapon. Oh! Let's well, well, them. well, that's... You have to be now. It feels like... Oh, wow. Cheating. And... Doctor. Whoa! Can it just... Alright, where do we have someone? There. Boom! There we go. And this guy. Boom! What? Sly Fox, this one. Oh, that's not a good place to be. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, you're, you did your dirty tricks? That's not gonna help you. Let's finish it quickly. Okay. Jump. What? Hell awaits you! <laughs> wow, we're just having a good old time here. So much jumping. Let's see. You don't like spearmen? You really don't like spearmen. Oh, but we do like loot. And what do we have left? A few here. Oh, that guy. He's a uh, feisty. You. Knock you down. You're a dog. One left. Oh, that's the wrong way you're running. Oh, wow. You're actually hurting. With a sling? Come on. Be serious. Yeah, Doug. Take him. Oh, that's awesome. Awesome. Cool. Now what? Have a look around. All of you. I want no more surprises. Right. I'll check the longhouse. Scavengers might still be hiding in the remains of the longhouse. I like that longhouse. Look at that sweet longhouse. Luckily, we can spot him quite easily. Oh, we'll go in the main raid. Wait. Who are you? Are you with those brigands as well? Sigurd, Dag, in here. Those men had prisoners. Hmm. You there! Untie us! Let us walk and we will not hurt you! Quite bold in those bindings. I like your spirit. We are very agreeable people, I promise. You need not kill us. Peace, friend. We have no need or wish to hurt you. What are your names? Yenli. I'm a merchant, not a bandit like those others. And this is Rowan. Rowan, that's right. I'm a stable hand, that's all. I keep horses and, well, I did, till those brigands sold them off. They meant to sell us next, as slaves to the nearest speeder. But I read their eyes out before I let that happen. And how did you find yourselves here? We came to trade with the sons of Ragnar, at Halfdan Jarl's asking. But they were gone when we arrived. Hmm. Unbind them. You know the sons of Ragnar? Aye. Sold many a mare and stallion to the brothers. Good men. Always paid me fair. From the look of this camp, they've been gone for some time. Where will you go now? What will you do? Repeat my stocks. Start anew. I have friends and allies across the land to aid me. But it won't be easy. Every town and village needs a stable. To keep horses fit and trim. I'll find my footing again. Somewhere. Hmm. What are you thinking? <laughs> we could use their skills as we get settled. <laughs> Having access brightest to train Trayon. someone to tend our mounts would be a boon. My thoughts as well. Any friend of the Ragnarsons is a friend of mine. Right, Doug? Sure. Whatever you think is best, Sigurd. Janli, Rowan, I am Sigurd Jarl of Fornberg, son of Stirbjörn. This is Eivor, 
and Dag. Both of you are free to go, but more than welcome to stay if you're willing to pull your weight. We'd be happy to, if only to get back on our feet. Then let it be done. The Raven Clan welcomes you. All right. Got some retainers. From strangers into friends into family. The others have arrived. Come. I have a good feeling about this place. Very good feeling. It's going to be a bustling Honored metropolis. Family, friends, welcome to your new home. Go, Northumbria, Mercia, East Anglia, and Essex. There we go. Look at that beautiful little township we got. A hamlet. I think it's a hamlet. See what we can do with this one. Let's see if we get our. Oh, there's still more cutscene. There's a long, lot of cutscene in this one, but Fine that's the main work. story. A long house to rival any I've seen. Now come, Ranvi has found something I would like you to see. Eivor, Sigurd, I give you England and its four kingdoms. Mercia. East Anglia, Northumbria, and Wessex. Wessex, that's what it's called. From the few plans and maps I discovered here, I believe the sons of Ragnar have pushed further into Mercia, here. My scouts will soon tell me if I am correct. And where are we? Here, in this unnamed copse of trees. Unnamed? We cannot let that stand. What will we call this place? I might have an idea. Ravensthorpe, the village of ravens. There you go, it's already in the map. You're just reading it. Hmm, I like it. The poet in you sings once again. One day this name will be known throughout all of England. A name is only a beginning. If we want renown, we must build, expand. Agreed. We should begin with a forge. Can you help Gunnar get working again? We'll need cargo, supplies. For that our neighbors will provide. Whether they our wish neighbors. to or not. I love Scarcely it. Scarcely arrived and now we must raid. We I cannot mean. master this land merely by asking. <laughs> I'll go and speak with Gunnar now. <laughs> our neighbors will provide. Good work, my dear. There we go. What else? So that is seems to be a great point to wrap this one up here. We have just arrived in England and it's so full of new things like tons of new quests and locations and sub quests and all of that cool stuff so many things to do uh, let's just get those skill points out of the way and then we can get our sprinting attack press R1 while sprinting we'll try that one cool I think I'll be using that a lot that did not look like a sprinting that's walking and that's running doesn't really look like much. Anyway, we are going to wrap this one up here. And next time we're going to start with uh, fixing this. Uh, yeah, fixing. Yeah, fixing this hamlet and turning it into something. The village and see if our neighbors will provide something to us. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you are enjoying the series as we progress into the story. And now finally reach England. See you next time. Until then, take care and stay effective.